What's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you a brand new product. Not really a brand new product, but a brand new company of a product that you've all been familiar with. For you guys that know about the Mac RBRT bits, today I'm going to introduce you to the Grip Edge RPT. So in this video, I'm going to show you the similarities and why it's much easier for you to access these than ever before. So you guys, check this out. All right guys, like I mentioned in the intro today, we're gonna to be discussing the Grip Edge RPT bits. That stands for Rounding Prevention Technology. Now you may not be familiar with these, but you're definitely familiar with these. These are the Mac RBRT bits. Now these were sold exclusively to Mac tools um, and they branded them as RBRT. The difference is not everybody had a Mac tool dealer in fact, out of all the videos we did, that's probably the most popular comment that I don't have a Mac truck, I don't have a Mac dealer. So Grip Edge is the company that produces these bits. Yes, you heard me correct. These bits are these bits unbranded Mac. All right, so that's not taking anything away from the Mac guys or the Mac tool fans. All the RBRT stuff will still be available through your Mac truck. But obviously, Mac has a smaller chain of trucks across the United States, so it makes their availability much more limited. So RBRT is only available through Mac, the Grip Edge RPT, and you can see, I'll get some close-ups of everything. They're exactly the same bits. These are the OEM makers of these. So let's get that out of the way to start with. Now, some of you guys may not be familiar with any of these bit technology at all. So let me do a real quick run through. It's here is a 3D model. And you can see it's kind of a unique design for a hex head bits. We're usually not seeing this kind of a cavity cut into the bits. And these are designed for a very specific purpose. Um, this U-shaped channel that's in here allows you to put pressure on the flat sides as well as the points inside of a hex fastener. And the design of that, it actually pulls pressure inward as you try to loosen or tighten the bit where a conventional hex will just apply outward torque or pressure going outwards. Now, the RPT, um, their claim is it'll allow you to put up to 50% more torque on a good fastener and up to 400% more torque on a damaged or compromised fastener. Now this is the part that I really want to focus on in this video. They put their name, Rounding Prevention Technology. Now there's a reason why they name these bits this, because they are designed to prevent you from stripping a, a good fastener to start with. Now, in my opinion, where Mac fell short when they marketed the RBRT to the end customer is they only focused on the extraction capabilities of these hex bits. Now, I truly believe um, that that was marketed wrong. Uh, if you use these bits to start with, the chances of you stripping a hex head fastener is far less because you can apply more torque to them from the design that's in here with these cavities. So keep that in mind, these are not used as an extractor. Don't use your Snap-on bits or your Matco bits or your Sun-X bits or your Gear Wrench bits and get yourself in a jam. Use these first to start with and prevent that damage from happening so you don't round them off. But in the instance that you already have come across a fastener that somebody damaged before you, these will allow you to have a much greater fighting chance of getting a damaged fastener out than before. So I know a lot of you guys are like, oh yeah, I'm sure this is the same bits as RBRT. So I know there's gonna be some skepticism 
on this, but we all have seen the videos that Dan, the RBRT guy, did on his channel. So I went to Florida, I took the first look at these, and I actually shot a video with Dan, and I'll insert that video here, and that way you guys can see it. So before we get into that video, I wanna run through the, the sets that they have, okay? They've got metric and standard bit sets. They've got a three inch drive set and a quarter inch drive set. So in the video that we're doing with Dan, it shows all the sizes, it covers the part numbers for the sets and the whole nine yards. Now, one of the advantages that Grip Edge has given everybody in America is now you can have access to these on your tool trucks, okay? These are gonna be sold to tool trucks exclusively through the mobile tool network. So if your dealer is part of the mobile tool network, he can order these. You can save a little money on them because you're not paying the Mac tax on them. They still have the full lifetime warranty on them, just like the Mac RBRT bits. And for you guys that do have a Mac truck and you've kind of been on the fence about purchasing the RBRT, this gives you a chance to get into this tool line without spending quite as much money. So that's a good thing for all of us in the tool industry. So without any further ado, check this video out and that way you guys can see it yourself. All right guys, we're back with Dan Styers. Um, this is awesome what, what Dan's got going on here and I'm gonna let Dan take it, let him introduce himself, introduce you to these brand new products. Um, that way you guys can get some tools that you need. So Dan, I'm gonna let you have it. Thanks Clay. Hey guys, my name's Dan Steyer and I'm with a brand new company, Grip Edge Tools. And we're here to talk to you today about a brand new neat new technology called RPT, Rounding Prevention Technology. You know, isn't it better to not start with a problem to begin with? My new product is centered at, around the Allen or hex head fastener. And I know you guys do this for a living, so you totally understand how frustrating it can be when you round out that Allen fastener or you come across one that's been stripped by somebody else. RPT will prevent you from rounding the fastener. That's the main point we want to try to get across. Use it first, grab it, take those fasteners out, don't round them. However, this neat new patented technology will allow you to take a damaged fastener out and put up to 400% more torque on that fastener than a conventional hex design. That's right guys, you heard me right. Up to 400% more torque on a damaged fastener. So it is to be used as your primary tool. It is the next generation design that you're gonna use every day in the shops to prevent, but it will also remove damaged fasteners. So I've got uh, a demo block here. And in the demo block, I've got a good hex fastener and I've got one that's been drill rounded out. I've got a conventional hex tool design here to show you know what, it fits in the good one and it will crack it loose like it should and tighten it back down because that's a good fastener in good shape and that's a standard hex design. Put it into the drill rounded one however and this is what we get. There is absolutely no chance that that tool is gonna remove that fastener. Okay, we'll swap over to the RPT bit to show you that the RPT bit is not oversized. There's no smoke and mirrors. It actually fits into the standard one just fine and we'll crack them loose and tighten them back down just like any other hex design. But you come across one that's been rounded, fit that RPT down in the bottom of that fastener and I can crack them loose and tighten them back down again. No trouble whatsoever. RPT is the newest design in bit socket technology that will prevent you from rounding out fasteners, but you come across those ones that have been stripped rounded by somebody else or age and time and rust corrosion, RPT is absolutely your best fighting chance of getting it out. They get down in the bottom of those fasteners, lock in tight. Now the whole technology is designed about pulling the pressure inward rather than pushing to the outside corners. You know, when you put a hex head tool into a fastener and you apply torque, all that torque gets pushed to the corners. Basically, you stretch the inside of the fastener and it allows that tool to round over. So guys, I know a lot of people have looked at this design and they've confused it for a Torx bit. I want you to make sure, because it's the only hex head 
on the planet that has these U-shaped cavities machined into it. There's some very interesting machining work going on that allows our design to work. So make sure you understand these are for Allen or hex head fasteners only, okay? So let me go ahead and show you what we've got for the sets. First one I wanna show you is our 3H drive metric set from four millimeter to 10 millimeter. It's a seven piece set, okay? And we're gonna go ahead and put the part numbers on the screen as I start going through these. So that's the seven piece metric set, four to 10 millimeter. Next up, we've got the 3H drive SAE set from an eighth of an inch to three eighths, three eighths drive, so a seven piece set, eighth inch to three eighths. Next, we've got the quarter inch drive metric set and it is an eight piece set from 1.5 to seven millimeter. You body shop guys are gonna love that, motorcycle shop guys. 1.5 millimeter to seven millimeter, eight piece set. And then we've got the 11 piece SAE quarter inch drive set from a 16th of an inch to 930 seconds. So you have a really good broad range of sizes through these four sets in quarter drive and 3 eighths drive. Once again, guys, the name of the company is Grip Edge Tools. The name of the product is RPT. We are launching it through the Mobile Tools Network. Make sure you get a hold of your distributor and get them signed up on the MTN Network so that you can get these great new tools on their truck and in your box. The truly a game-changing new technology that you'll use in the shop every day. I'm Dan Steyer with Grip Edge Tools. I really appreciate Clay's, you know, letting me come onto the channel. Clay, thank you so very much. All right, guys. So uh, obviously, you say something you need, and you say something how it can help you through your day to day. And I kind of want to touch on a point that you did. Um, these are to prevent rounding. Absolutely. Like, you don't get to this stage. Look at there. It's bit in. Bit in. They lock in. Yeah. So you don't get to this stage if you have this and use it in the new stage. So, Correct. man, thank you very much for coming. Yes, sir. Um, and like always, guys, check these tools out. These guys do a great job. And like always, if you like the stuff you see, hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes in the description. If you're not subscribed, super, super, super easy. All you gotta do is click that button. You guys have a great week. Check out Dan's channel. Y'all guys have an awesome day. See ya. Thank you.